anyone any more questions if not i'll try to talk about the next one called as an logging dot properties file the login dot property file is a, an important file which contains about just give me one minute Uh, hi everyone. Sorry for that. Uh, some personal emergency calls. Yeah. So the next one we have is a logging dot property files. So whatever the logging related property files that are there, okay. Uh, the, whatever the logging related configuration is there inside my standalone mode, all that information will be recorded under the logging dot property files. So if you see here by default. The log level that is being defined here is the info. So for any reason, I don't want the for some reason I decided that no having all the info related information. It's eating away my log file. I don't want the info. I want only the error or exception. You can define that. And if you see the log handlers, don't worry about the terminology called as handlers or levels. I'll talk about in detail about that little later. We're trying to talk about the logging subsystem. So if you see the handlers that are there, okay, the handler by default that is available here is the file and the console, which means to say that all the logging related information will be recorded in a file. So for some reason you're not comfortable about this, you want to override this. You can comfortably define inside the logging dot properties file. Clear, not clear.
silence alazim it's clear if it's clear i want 